main water shutoffs to your house. So you have one main water shutoff that's going to isolate um, your home. Um, and when I say isolate, you should have a separate line that goes over and feeds the vegetation if you do have um, a sprinkler system as well. But one thing that you're going to want to do is you're going to want to make sure that you have shut off valves on each of those items, one to the sprinkler line and one that goes inside the house so that you can shut the house down in case of an emergency. Um, that should be located on the front. It should be visible. Um, I've seen them in a garage a time or two, but usually not. Usually they're right on the front of the house where the hose bib is. You have a hose hooked up out there to water, uh, but make sure that that works and test it. And if you don't know how, then you call Plumbing Masters and have us come out and test it for you and make sure that it works properly because you do not want to have a valve that's old and outdated that does not shut water off if it's flooding your house.